Hey Pisces, what's going on with this light? All right, I guess I should move. How's it going, guys? Happy December. I'm feeling a little off today. I haven't checked the moon <laughs> to see what's going on, but um, just like the winter is getting to me. So I'm gonna see what's going on with Pisces for December. Take me out. All right. Okay. okay, Pisces, guys. Sun, moon, rising, Venus, Mercury, Jupiter. Too many cards. Keep that one. Take these three. Wow. <laughs> okay. So I got two Pisces cards here. Um, the Moon and the High Priestess. So you guys are getting very deep in your intuition and your kind of um, deep inner psyche. Um, there's a Two of Wands. So I feel like you guys are really exploring the dynamics of this partnership. Um, you're really trying to use your intuition when it comes to it. I feel like you guys are um, working in sync together and um, if there is any issues coming up, you're uh, trying to intuitively navigate them, but there may be some things hidden under the surface. So we got a page of pentacles, a knight of swords. And the sun reverse so with the sun reverse and the moon I definitely feel like there's some hidden things going on here um, some of you might be dealing with a Gemini Libra or Aquarius um, but you're really working on um, looking forward to the future and the things that you want to create and establish and um, see what this knight of swords this gemini libra aquarius is going on the chariots reverse so i feel like there is either sort of like a resistance to move and charge ahead even though i do see the page of pentacles is up right here or um there was a cancer involved, um, but they're now not involved anymore. So the King of Pentacles is reversed here. So I feel like there is someone in this situation that's very uh, materialistically driven, kind of um, shallow, um, kind of like, like the King of Pentacles reversed. So the King of Pentacles is like stable, financial, um, sort of like a very good with money but I feel like king of pentacles or verse can be the qualities of like driven but to an excess and like this extreme like power hungry kind of person in the situation so but um okay so there's a death card which came up with the three of cups and the four of swords reversed so i feel like somebody sort of needs to take like a pause here because someone's being very like i guess because i see this like knight of swords and then this four of swords reversed i kind of feel like someone's like going like full speed ahead but kind of needs to like take a breather and calm down um, this Three of Cups, I feel like there could be a lot of, like, partying and maybe even, like, um, a lack of self-care and sort of, like, um, a lot of, like, toxic, like, behaviors happening, um, to an excess is the feeling I'm getting. Like, yeah, like, with the King of Pentacles reverse, like, a very indulgent kind of energy. So, be careful that you guys aren't, like, you know doing drugs and getting into this um, place where you're just doing, having a lot of unhealthy behaviors. 
um, with the death card, I feel like this is, might be an area that you need a, or you might be coming out of a period where you were partying a lot, and, um, yeah, so, let's see what else is happening here. I feel like now would be a good time for you guys to start exploring some, like, spiritual um, paths with this Hierophant, which could be some sort of, like, um, spiritual community, and then the universe is sort of, like, there's a lot of things, I think, karmically happening to you guys that you can really benefit from looking at your decisions and this, um, situations around you and really start getting more insight, because the High Priestess and the Moon is here, too, so I feel like you guys... With the Four of Swords reverse, you haven't been using this time to really self-evaluate, but I think it is what is happening. Um, is it's at, the universe is calling you to delve into these spiritual meanings of things, and um, this Magician reverse, I feel like you guys are sort of ignoring the powers like in and around you. I feel like. Um, you're kind of trying to take things into your own hands, but you're maybe not wanting... I don't know, let's see what this Magician Reverse is about. I want to use my other deck. Well, you know what, forget it. I'll just keep working with this one. What is this Magician Reverse about? Okay, so we have a Queen of Wands. So some of you might have a Sagittarius, Aries, or Leo in your life that maybe could be, I don't know, I kind of feel like they could be like a bad influence on you is the feeling I'm getting. Um, yeah. Queen of Wands. Four of Pentacles reversed and Eight of Pentacles. So what this is telling me is like don't let go of your um, like passion or your skill or whatever it is that keeps you grounded like in yourself. Don't get too caught up in this relationship with this queen of wands which could be a guy a man too it's just the energy the feminine fire energy um and don't let them pull you out of like the things that because with this magician reverse i feel like they could be sort of manipulating you and it's really important that you keep focused on harnessing your powers and your skills for the rest of December. Hmm. Two of Cups is here, so it's okay to be in this partnership, but um someone in this partnership is sort of out for themselves so be weary of someone who is not necessarily has your best interest in mind because they have their best interest in mind is the feeling i'm getting i just pulled one more card that five of swords is um this is a virgo card also um Let's see what this bird or heads about. Hmm. This tower wanted to come out a couple of times, so you have the Page of Wands reversed, Queen of Swords, and Tower. So some of you might have had some major breakthrough, breakdown, breakaway 
from an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Um, this page of wands, I feel like, is this lack of ability to move forward from the harsh words of someone is a feeling getting like someone was very harsh with their words and it really affected you and it's caused you to feel like you can't move forward correctly so that's my reading for you guys i'll see you guys in january happy holiday season bye pisces